we are heading to Yuma to check out a couple of parks and to visit a classmate from high school and his wife. Piglet's looking for his cat that she saw in the middle. We are in Yuma. We stayed here. Right there. And there's Daisy. And there's two pleasure ways. Parked in the same parking lot. Park. I'm not sure what the actual name of the park is. The sign that said Gateway was pretty big, so I'm going to assume that's. That's the name. But it's got this walking and biking trail that goes for miles, I'm told, down that way. And you can see a Catholic church that I'm told is on the reservation. And we have a dog, a dog that's swimming in the river here. And he is loving it. I wonder if he's chasing fish or something. I've never seen a dog bark in them while swimming before. So it's a very pretty park. <laughs> and the dog is still at it. I don't know how far this river goes, but wherever it goes, that's where that dog is headed, I think. So, looks like 0.8 miles uh, is the distance to the West Wetlands. And then it says stay hydrated. Well, I didn't bring any water. And I have little Miss Piglet with me. And she's already getting tired. <laughs> so maybe we'll try that tomorrow or something. We are at the Wetlands Park in Yuma. We were going to walk, hike here from the Gateway Park, but... I don't think Piglet can make it that far, and I didn't want to leave her in the van, so we drove down here. But we're going to walk around a bit and see what we see. You like the grass, Piglet? Piglet. Piglet. You're not paying any attention to me, Piglet. <laughs> Let's go over here and look at the ducks. Oh, they saw us coming, and now they're swimming away. They're so graceful. And there's some big ducks over there. Oh, there they go. And there's two sailboats out there. That's pretty cool. Let's go see if pets are allowed, Piglet. Pets not allowed. Well, we can't go in. This very nice park. Somebody leaves their trash. And there's a trash can right over there. I'm not sure what these trees are, but something out here smells very fragrant and good. I think it might be this guy. Ow. 
so peaceful here. So many birds. Wow. I like this little spot right here. It's like a little highway. If I was a kid, I'd be climbing all over that tree. Well, this one is tired of walking. So we have to turn around and go back. But I need to get a backpack or front pack or something for her so we can go on longer hikes on the paths that allow dogs, that is. So if anybody knows of a good brand that's small enough for a Chihuahua, I had one that went over your shoulder, but it was so big that her head didn't even stick out the top. So. I don't know what happened to it. I think we gave it away or something. So, anyway, if you got any recommendations, let me know in the comments. You ready to hit the road, Piglet? I let Piglet ride in the chair turned backwards because the sun usually blasts her in the face through the windshield. And also, if I slam on the brake, she's safer here. Rather than flying through the windshield, she'll just be smashed up against the back of the chair. Yeah, I know. Take a nap. Lick the chair. Well, here we are at Du Bois Italian Restaurant in downtown Yuma, having lunch with Gary Pistol and his wife Lucy. I didn't know Gary very well back in high school but I couldn't pass up the chance to meet up with them knowing that they were here in Yuma and I was here too. So unfortunately, I didn't record any video, but we had a great time.